Pass by 310 here with the little two gamers. I didn't believe Que pasa mis amigos for all you Spanish uh, goers out there. Sorry, I don't know any other languages. Uh, if you want to teach me how to say what's up, please leave it in the comment and I will try to say it if I can actually read it. Um, playing a little Skyrim. I know this is not the beginning of Skyrim. This is my first Skyrim video. I decided to uh, make my character and then go about doing stuff. Um, so I didn't really think that you guys wanted to see me make a character since you've seen you've probably seen all the other people make characters my character is about the same as anybody else's I chose Nord um, I have like a mohawk but as you see I've covered up with armor you don't really get to see your person throughout this game okay I didn't even ask to talk to you like I said I'm glad to help in any way I can help yourself to whatever you need within give me your shoes you don't even have anything. I already jacked everything for you. So anyways, this is Skyrim. Um, I just, if you haven't seen the beginning of this game, basically the game starts with you on a wagon. Um, you're getting, you're being escorted into town because uh, these people caught you. They think you're a, they think you're a rebel. Um, I wouldn't say that. They think but you're a rebel, so they're basically going to kill off all the rebels, so they ask the you Empire your name, that's how it starts it. out, and then you create but a character, after you create Valgrif a character, they basically uh, put you in a line and they basically call you up by name, and then they start executing people, and then once they get to you, um... Of course, um, a dragon she made comes and saves you, and that's how you run away with this with this dude, this long-haired dude right here, and you come to meet this chick, really her, that's his sister, her and basically she's Kuru helping you, and right now this is basically... She's basically dead. telling me the background information Ulfric about some sure people right now, so... Ulfric killed the High King? Some say murders, but it was a lawful challenge in the old way. So you didn't miss much. All you missed was the dragon saving me and then me running away. After the, after the dragon tried to save me, he tried to kill me. And I had to run away and basically I met her here. No, not until the moot meets to choose another. And it won't meet until one side or the other wins the war. So there's, so there's no king. Though. Ulfric is our rightful high king. He'll drive out the Empire, and Skyrim will have peace at last. Hmm, there's no king. Maybe that could be me. <laughs> just kidding. Uh -huh. What do you think about the war? The Empire may have been good for Skyrim once upon a time, but those days are long That dual-wielded swords, look how Spanning beast this is. Of Palos was the last straw. Valmor everywhere, dragging people off for honoring our own gods. I'm glad Raelof is helping drive them out of here. If I was a bit younger, I might have joined the fight myself. Mm -hmm. All right, done talking to you. I. You. I hope to see you in Windhelm. Good luck. How do I join the Stormcloud? Ulfric's capital is Windhelm, northeast of here. You'll want to talk to Galmar Stonefist, Ulfric's right-hand man. He handles the new recruits. I'll be sure to put in a good word if I get to Windhelm ahead. Of okay. You. Thank you. Hello, Hod. So you saw a dragon? Yes. Just... Tell me, what was it? It was humongous. It tried to kill me. Much bigger than that. As big as an inn. As big as the inn. Maybe I'll see you one for yourself soon. Well, I'll be. That would be a sight to yes. see. Yes. Uh, not that I actually want to see one, understand. I hope that dragon stays far away from here. Bye bye. Alright, let's see what I have to do. Quest. Talk to Jarl of Witrun. I'll talk to that chick. Alright, let's go talk to this person. Talk to Jarl. Can I go in the house? I'm about to pick the lock and go steal some shit in this guy's house. The picking lock, the lock picking is just like Fallout. If you ever play Fallout, then you'll know how to pick a lock right away.
So far, I've only played this game for maybe like uh. Hey! I'm not gonna warn you again. Get out or I'll call the guards. Uh -oh. You should have listened. Guards! Help! No! I'll get it out! Sorry! Look, no guards are coming. What? What? I'm gonna come back later. Just watch. I hear someone humming. Oh well. I don't get how to use this compass at the top. Maybe you just walk towards it. So anyways, I've only played this game for maybe 40, 40 minutes. So far it's, it's pretty fun. Um, it's like Fallout if you ever played Fallout, but different setting. If you ever played Oblivion, then you'll be familiar. Um, um, I heard that if you get into this game, you're not going to want to quit. So hopefully uh, I get into the game as people say. Like It's supposed to be a really good game. That's what, one of the main reasons I bought it. I like RPGs. Hello, Alvor. Ain't every... Whatever you need. Buy you some... I see no harm in it, if you have the skill. The grindstone will improve your weapons. Use the table to improve your armor. If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. Gerda's family first settled here as well. Right now I'm just starting out so I don't have that many missions, so I just have to go around talking to people. So this may be a little boring to most people, because uh, all I do is walking around. You don't see any action. So, what the hell just happened? Oh, this is the my skills that I can use. Hi. Hmm. See a map. Alright, so my current location, and I have to go over here, so let's set that destination. Let me set the destination, you jerk. Looks like I have a long walk ahead of me. On the road again. I can't wait to get on the road again. The graphics are amazing in this game. So far, I've seen all the graphics. Amazing, amazing, amazing job. You can see waterfalls, you see the full of water, all the trees, every little detail from the swords to the to the uh, shields to just crap flying in your face. Amazing detail. What's this? Gotta give me some lunch. Nah, I'm not gonna kill. Actually, if it lets me get close enough, I'm gonna kill it. All right, come here. Oh, there's a wolf. Ah, oh. ah, oh. f you, wolf. What's that? Hopefully those people are good, and I don't have to fight them. Put these away. Act, act normal. What's this? Should I free him? I'll have to fight these people if I free him. Alright, yes. Did you know it? Ah, Kraken, shut up! Where's my health? Oh, right there. Ah, 
health low. You should drink a potion or use health. Oh, wait, 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 calm down. Wait, time out. Time out. No, I don't want that. Want items. Potions. Use. Use. Oh, and I just got worked on. I don't even know where my health bar is. Well, that sucked. So much for trying to free a freaking... What's it called? Prisoner. Oh, look, a mammoth. Doo -doo. Let's look at this detail. Alright, so... I guess I start off from my last checkpoint. So, yeah, uh... I'm going to end it here, come back for me trying to uh, figure out how to play this game, and um, maybe I'll try to free that soldier again and just long range it. Anyways, peace out, thanks for watching.